Now, visuals coming in from our neighboring country, Pakistan, are a big testimony to the shambles that the country currently is in. Both the Pakistan Muslim League, that is the Nawaz Sharif faction, and the PTI are now claiming victory in the recently concluded elections. Independent candidates backed by Imran Khan attained the majority. Nawaz Sharif is the help, but it was Nawaz Sharif which delivered a, who delivered a victory speech, promising that it was he who will form the government in Pakistan. He further asked the other parties to join hands with him and then they'll form the majority government. Nawaz Sharif said that it will be his party that will hold alliance talks with Vilabal Bhutto and also the other parties. Meanwhile, PTI supporters staged a massive protest in various parts of the country. They are alleging that there has been vote rigging that took place during counting. Social media is also flooded with videos showing massive poll rigging taking place inside the polling booths. मुझे आप सब पर पूरा भरोसा था कि आप वोट देने निकलेंगे आपने मेरे भरोसे का मान रखा और आपके मैसिव टर्नआउट ने सबको हैरान कर दिया है लंदन प्लान फेल हो चुका है आपके वोट की वजह से नवाज शरीफ एक कम जर्फ इंसान है जिसने ऑफिशियल नतज के मुताबिक 30 सीट्स पीछे होते हुए भी विक्ट्री स्पीच कर दी है इंडिपेंडेंट जराय के मुताबिक एक नेशनल असम्बली की सीट्स पर हम जीत रहे थे धांधली शुरू होने से पहले और इस वक्त हम 170 से ज्यादा नेशनल असेंबली की सीट्स पर जीत रहे हैं फॉर्म 45 के डेटा के मुताबिक मेरे पाकिस्तानियों आप सब ने तारीख रकम कर दी है मुझे आप पर बहुत फख्र है और मैं अल्लाह का शुक्र अदा करता हूं कि उसने हमें एक कौम बना दिया है आपने घबराना नहीं है सेलिब्रेट करें और शुक्राना के नफल पढ़ें दो साल के सख्त जुल्म और नासाफियों के बावजूद हमने 2024 हजार चौबीस सेलेक्शन दो तहाई अक्सरियत से जीत लिया है सब ने आपके वोट की ताकत देखी है अब वोट की हिफाजत करने की सलाहियत भी दिखाएं पाकिस्तान जिंदाबाद मुस्लिम लीग नून इज द लार्जेस्ट सिंगल पार्टी इन द कंट्री टूडे आफ्टर द इलेक्शन और मैं समझता हूं कि हमारा फर्ज है कि इस मुल्क को भंवर से निकाला जाए ये इलेक्शन हुए पीसफुल हुए और पीसफुली इतना इतनी बड़ी फोर्सेस डिप्लॉय हुई छह लाख से ज्यादा फोर्सेस डिप्लॉय हुई क्यूआरएफ फोर्सेस डिप्लॉय हुई एविएशन की क्यूआरएफ फोर्सेस डिप्लॉय हुई लेवीज डिप्लॉय हुई पुलिस डिप्लॉय हुई और उसके बाद खुदा का शुक्र है सिविलियंस में हमारे पास चार डेथ्स हुई कल वाकत में जो मैंने आपको पचपन वाकत के दो बच्चे और दो हमारे जो है एडल्ट जो है वो शहीद हुए चार और उन्होंने उसके बाद हमें इसको जो है दुनिया में प्रोजेक्ट करना चाहिए कि दिस इज व्हाट वी डिड एंड दिस इज व्हाट वी अचीव नाउ पाकिस्तानी जर्नलिस्ट जीशान आरिफ इज नाउ जॉइनिंग मी फ्रॉम लाहौर ऑन द स्टोरी जीशान द इलेक्शंस वर रादर पीसफुल यू नो वी डिड नॉट सी एनी मेजर इंसिडेंट ऑफ वायलेंस बीइंग रिपोर्टेड फ्रॉम एनी पार्ट ऑफ द कंट्री बट इट वाज इन फैक्ट द रिजल्ट एंड द क्लेम्स दैट आर नाउ बीइंग मेड बाय ऑल द पार्टीज दैट हैज शॉक्ड एवरीवन Uh, well exactly the, uh, uh, the polling process uh, on the 8th of february all day it remained uh, peaceful uh, we though, though we seen uh, some violence uh, leading to the day of the polling uh, before that there was a blast in the uh, balochistan and other parts of the country as well uh, but on the polling day uh, things remained the same um, it was smooth polling process and uh, people were allowed to vote and there was no um, major protest or anything like that but what happened was that when polls closed uh, the situation changed after that and uh, we've continuously been talking about that what what's happening in the country right now um we saw another development last night when nawaz sharif uh, made his speech uh, which uh, many observers are criticizing because it uh, was not the time to announce a victory speech because his party is nowhere to claim uh, the victory they are uh, they, they won uh, so far 71 seats and uh, pti is backed independent candidates are uh, touching the uh, 100 figures at the moment but pti is claiming that uh, they are uh, there are like 52 seats which are uh, where the, the results is disputed and they will be going to the courts uh, and we saw we saw last night uh, pti is candidates from the hall Uh, Barrister Salman Akram Raja he filed a petition in Lahore High Court and Lahore High Court's justice he um, ruled in his favor and he stayed that decision. So uh, he has asked uh, of the Election Commission of Pakistan to start recounting. So this is just one seat. We are talking about 52 seats which PTI is claiming that they have won. 
but on the uh, form 47 which was which was issued by the election commission right. the election commission has uh, decided in the favor of the other party so there is going to be a legal battle and uh, we're seeing protests on the road as well um, after the election. So the situation is uh, unfolding and we, we are seeing uh, new developments happening uh, uh, every day. Right, Zizar, you know, you're speaking about the protests that are taking place. In fact, a lot of candidates from the PTI had actually hit the streets. And now you're saying that the resort that they will turn to will be the resort of knocking on the doors of the election commission and also knocking on the doors of the courts. Exactly, that's uh, what, what's going to happen. But uh, one thing I should make clear is that the other parties and the election commission and uh, uh, those who undermine the uh, will of the people, uh, what, what they uh, miscalculated is that the Imran Khan, it's been like 10 years uh, since to, uh, 2013 elections, he has been uh, educating his voters uh, and his supporters about the importance of Form 45, uh, which is the official documents. If there are like uh, 200 polling stations in a constituency, and by the end of the day, um, all the 200 constituencies, uh, the officer there, uh, residing officers, they issue a form which is called Form 45. That carries the result of that uh, polling stations. So uh, the PTI candidates who have even lost, as I mentioned, the 52 right. seats PTI is claiming to have won. Uh, so uh, they, they have collected Form 45. So what, what's happening right now is that PTI, on the basis of all those polling stations, where they have collected Form 45, they have won. But on the other side, the Election Commission, when they issued Form 47, uh, they have uh, declared them uh, runners-up. So that's what's happening. Uh, th there is some kind of rigging uh, going on behind curtains, right. uh, which uh, PTI is claiming. And uh, that's why they're going to the courts and they're on street as well. Thank you, Zeeshan, for giving us all those details. Rather peaceful elections being held in Pakistan, but it looks like the candidates will be now knocking on the doors of the court.